Hello, and we are back with more Final Fantasy VIII. I believe this is part 19. I had to consult my iPad, which I put my to-do list on of when to record what. Uh, but uh, this is part 19. Uh, we just defeated Rajin and Fujin, who have sided with Seifer and the Sorceress. Uh, that was a bitch and a half of a fight. Uh, it took me about two hours to do it. And I had to get outside help because I didn't know what to do. I, I didn't know what to do. I couldn't figure out how to defeat these fuckers. And it was a pain in the dick. And I had to get my husband help. The last episode is basically, you can skip this, skip that. It's just a, a filler episode of me explaining what's going on and everything like that with the voiceover. And it's all time-lapsed and everything because two hours. Two fucking hours it took. Um, I went a little insane. I went a little insane. Uh, and I know, like, some people might be wanting me to, like, you know, talk about what I'm doing to, you know, get these boss fights down, everything like that. But the thing is, like, I'd rather have more story in each episode than boss, than fighting. Uh, because I, I, okay, I'm gonna be real. I'm in Final Fantasy games for the story. Not so much the fighty fight. Whereas Mass Effect 3, which you can check out another... Just go check it out on my channel. There's a whole playlist dedicated to Mass Effect 3. Um, I'm there for the fighting and the story. Uh, so a lot less is time-lapsed. Um, and when I played Final Fantasy 7 Remake, I was there for the story and the fighting. But it, it just really depends. The older Final Fantasy games, I'm not so much here for the fighty fight fight. I am here for the story. I want to know. I want to know why everyone hates Squall. I want to know if Squall and Ryo, Riona, Rhinoa, whatever her name is, get together. I want to know what happens. And from my understanding, everybody hates Squall because he's Broody McBroodface. But literally, just look at the game four. Look at Final Fantasy VII, and you have the king of brooding. The king of brooding in emo, okay? He, yeah. Like, all the male protagonists in Final Fantasy are Broody McBroodface until you get to 13, and then it's Mrs. Broody McBroodface. Like, they're all broody. There's always a broody character. But anyway. We're gonna hop right back into it. This is literally right after the fight takes place. So it's going right into dialogue, and we're just gonna go in. Alright. Uh, Squall, are the two of you taking orders from a sorceress? Negative. She just yells a lot. The sorceress has nothing to do with us. We're acting on our own. Okay, own plan. Uh, we're on Seifer's side, you know? Uh, that's up to you, but enough is enough. This isn't an internet, internet, internal garden conflict. Why did I say international? Uh, we can't back out. Negative. Uh, Seifer has a lot of followers, but we're his only friends. We're a posse. The blah, 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 soldiers are only listening to Seifer because they fear the sorceress. Without us, Seifer wouldn't have a posse. If you guys stand by him, behind him that much, tell freaking Seifer to stop this nonsense. Affirmative. We ain't no sellouts. We're behind Seifer all the way. Mm. Okay, understood. So you want nothing to do with the garden now? Uh, from now on, we're not gonna hold back. Okay, please tell me I don't have to fight you again. Guess that's how it goes. That's what comrades are all about. You're just gonna let them go, Squall? Don't want to talk anymore. Kind of painful. Wimp. Oh, oh, don't kick him. Got a nice pants. Run. She talks so weird. It's just like one word, one, maybe two. I feel so sad. No oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> You said two Red Bulls. I didn't say two. Look at this. I asked for two Red Bulls. This man gets me two 12 packs. And a Lunchable. Just that I single. Two, three, four, I just said two Red Bulls. Yeah, it's 
Okay, move we'll we'll back. Pass. Move Eeyore. No, that is not connected. Oh my goodness. What happened? Thank you, baby. Alrighty then. Uh, I have enough Red Bull to last me a while. Be right back while I eat my snack. <laughs> Alright, now we are back in. Alright, let's do this. Uh, friend or foe, it all comes down to circumstance. Uh, that's how we were raised. It's nothing special. Nothing special. Is that true? Then what is this I'm feeling? Uh, sadness, because people you worked with and went to school with are now betraying you. Oh, depression, baby. Let's go. Where are we going next? Uh, uh, hello, excuse me. What is it? Have you decided on the on a destination? Still thinking? Uh, can we go to Trebia Garden? It's like in the mountains, so maybe the sorceress will leave it alone. But maybe you know. But I thought it was destroyed by the missiles. Oh, I see. That's why. Of course, she'd want to go. I'll keep that in mind. Thanks. Okay. We can go to the mountains. Uh, yes. We are ready to go. Oh, wait. Hold on. Uh... Okay. First of all, let's. No. Nope. 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 Item. Uh, this. That. Alright. Do that. Oh, item. Uh, I am. Brothers got kind of fucked up in that fight. Alright, and then Junction, let's get Squall another one. Now we go, Helmsman. Yes. Uh, bip, bip. Is this it? No, that's where we like came off of. Where are the mountains? That's the thing. I don't know. I assume this way. Okay, let me back on. Alright. Uh, it looks like we're in some mountains? Uh, but do I know where this garden is? Fucking no. Well, 
mountains. Was mountains. Where are you, little school? I'm go. Oh, so bitch. Forward. Thank you. I'd imagine it's by the sea. Or maybe it's this one over here. This island? Maybe? Maybe this one? Ah! A garden? Oh, it's a village. Okay, so this is not the right place. Uh, this is not a garden. This is a village. Okay. Uh, fucking freaky is what that is. Okay, but I imagine we gotta be close, right? God, I hate driving this thing. Why are you like this? Why are you like this? Can you... <gasps> yes! I can, you know, explore it and not have random encounters. This is probably gonna have me have a random encounter soon. Okay. Well, that looked like mountains, but that ended up not being mountains. The right mountains. I don't think. Peace. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, maybe it's in this more like deserty part of the. Like, I just automatically assumed it's being like, huh? What's huh? Is it? Uh, the gauge is going berserk. What gauge? Is 
that it? That looks like a garden. I got fucked up. Looks pretty bad. Like, it looks like a garden that got fucked up. Oh. He's gonna be so sad. Oh, I'm sorry, sweet pea. direct hit. Man, this really pisses me off. Aww. I'm going in. Uh, no, no, the fuck you're not. We should probably follow her inside. Like we should we should we should probably follow selfie. We we should not let her run off by herself. That is probably something we should not do. Uh have you guys seen selfie? Uh yeah, she's right over there. We're looking for selfie. Yeah, she ran off ahead. I wonder if there are any monsters around here. Come on, squad, let's hurry after her. Yeah, no shit. I was planning on doing that anyway. Oh masses. Like, you really think I'm just gonna let her run off by her goddamn lonesome? Uh, so... You've been looking after Selfie? Uh... Yeah. Selfie's been great help. Ah! Oh, she's so happy! Uh, what's wrong? That's not like Squall at all. Oh, You made her blush. Well, we gotta give credit where credit's due sometimes, you know? And be like, hey, like, you know, you have been helping out a bit. I really, like, lean far to the side of my camera, don't I? There should be a basketball court in the back. Wait for me there, okay? I want to go catch up with some of my friends. Okay. And do. Go to the basketball court. Got it. Got it. Got it. This way. <laughs> oh, this is a lot of graves. Hello. This is not... Oh, uh, these jackets on me. Try to go in the back. There is no back. But nope. That Tonberry King. Take this. Jesus. Do I gotta fight a Tonberry? I hate Tonberries. Oh, they expect the student body community to. Ugh. Oh, okay, cool. We're waiting here. I found it. Just took me a bit. Took me a half minute to find it. Uh, we're leaving soon as Selfie comes back. We're on standby till then. Got it. Which means a boss fight's gonna be coming up. I just fucking know it. Doesn't seem like the enemy has invaded the garden yet. Are they on their way? Ah, my ring is not behaving. Here we go. Uh, where's the sorceress? We have to find her and, uh, unalive her. Why did the sorceress come into the picture all of a sudden? Was was she actually waiting for this opportunity? Hmm. I wonder if she was living a normal life before all of this. Probably not. Why the search for alone? Alone inviting Squall back to the past, whereas the sorceress searches for it? Could it be that the sorceress is trying to make that journey into the past too? Probably so she doesn't marry our fucking headmaster. I've gotten... I've got to do something to show that selfie can depend on me. Oh, <laughs> I'm shaking so hard. You know, ever since I met all you, I've been doing some thinking. I can't stop thinking about it. I can't come up with the answer either. What the fuck are you thinking about? 
Okay, well, I try to leave. I try to leave. Ah, uh, there's basketball. Sorry to keep you waiting. Thanks so much for coming all the way out here, everyone. Cheer up, eh? Thanks. She's like, hey. Take me with you when you fight the sorceress, okay? I want to get even. I want my revenge. I can know. You have not been leveled up at all. Fucking no. Do we have to fight? Isn't there another way, you know, to avoid any bloodshed? <laughs> no. At this point, no. What are you saying all of a sudden? Maybe someone really smart can come up with a way so we wouldn't have to fight anymore. That's not gonna happen. Ma'am, this is... This is a Final Fantasy game. There is no... No bloodshedding. There is only bloodshed. We don't want peace. We want violence. I want my blanket to stop getting bunched up under my wheel. What are you getting at? If someone can come up with something, that'd be great. Uh, but no one's doing anything. They're all scared, uneasy. They do is complain. They just pretend to be thinking. I mean, fair. They criticize others, but in the end, they can't do anything either. We don't know why all this, all of a sudden. What do you expect from me? I grew up in the garden. I'm a seedy. You understand? Well, you have to voice your feelings or else I won't understand. <laughs> you were part of the resistance movement in Timber, right? Unlike others who were all talk, you took your own weapons and fought. And now you're saying all this? What happened to you? Uh, a lot of people died. It's called trauma. I guess I'm getting scared. Yeah, it's called trauma. Sometimes when I'm with all of you, I feel like we're on the same wavelength, you know? But when the battle start, battles start happening, it's different. Everyone's tempo seems to pick up and I get left behind. I try to catch up, but it's no use. Man, I have put you in every single battle so far. How far is everyone going? I can't hear anyone. Once I catch up, I wonder, is everyone safe? Will they welcome me with open arms? Is everyone okay? Will we all make it back together? When I start thinking like that, Fiona, I understand. Someone might not be there. Someone you love may disappear before your very eyes. It's, a, it's tough when you live your life thinking. But that's why I fight. When I was a little kid, I was about four or so. I was in an orphanage. Oh, we're getting sadness. Oh, we're getting sadness. Plenty of kids, all with no parent. It was around the end of the Sorceress's War, so I guess it couldn't be helped. Anyway, that's where I was. Um, is he gonna have his own little cowboy hat? And of all the kids there, one was very special to me. Irvy, one of all oh, Irvy! I really like this girl, and it made me so happy just talking to her. Seffy? What you playing? War! I can! Was that orphanage a stone house? You guessed it. They fought together. An old house made of stone by the ocean. You guessed it. I knew right away when we first met. Why did you tell us? Yes, why did you tell us? Because you two seem to have forgotten. It was just, it just kind of sucked that I was the only one who remembered. They all grew up together, spunky little self, spunky little Seffy, and bossy little Quincy. <gasps> Oh! Oh my god! Hey, do you guys remember setting off fireworks? That was... This way. Is that little baby sound? Was that little baby sound? Wait, did they all grow up together in the same orphanage? Is this where'd you go? You don't like me anymore? Oh, they all 
all grew up at the same orphanage. Oh my god. Riona's the only new one to the group. She didn't grow up there. How about this? Yeah! The ocean, the lighthouse. We did set off fireworks. Oh, yo, Zell. I don't know if that's little baby squall, because it's not when the kids aren't supposed to play with fireworks, Zell. I'll panic. I'm telling, I'm gonna tell on you. Cry, baby Zell, go back to bed. If I remember this, does that mean I was there too? We all got in big trouble. And what about my parents and Balaam? The Dinch and Balaam must have adopted you. Yep, that's probably it. I was there. Yo, come on, stop it! What? Oh. Hey, twin. Oh, is that Seifer? That's baby Seifer. Who's that? Nah, 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 nah. Stop teasing him, Seifer. Oh my goodness. Seifer, my arch enemy. Wow, he was there too? Well. Oh. They all grew up together. I think you were difficult to deal with. Always full of energy. Seifer was always Seifer. Zell always crying and screaming. Uh... This is actually kind of cute. Seifer was there too. Except for Riona, we were all there. Hey, that means... Squall was there too. Yeah, I was there too. I guess I was always waiting for sis to come back oh, I'm all alone but I'm doing my best I'll be okay without you sis I'll be able to take care of myself oh, I didn't turn out okay at all sis L L alone so Lone was sis? She was a bit older than us, and we all used to call her sis. Quintessel, Selfie, Irvine, Seifer, Lone, and myself. I'm not sure what the meaning behind all this is, but we were definitely together. You mean sis is Lone? Alone? She's the one that takes us back to Laguna's period. She said she wanted to change the past. I don't know why. There can only be one reason for that. She must not be happy with the present. If that's the case, I'm definitely up for helping her. Yeah, she's part of our orphanage gang. Oh, you didn't even remember who she was. Hey, Selfie, that goes for you too. Irvine remembered everyone. Pretty scary we've forgotten all these things. So Mom and Pa aren't my real parents? Nope, <laughs> you're adopted, dude. I wonder where the orphanage is. Hmm, so sis and alone, eh? Everyone was fond of sis, but you, Squall, you kept hogging her for yourself. You sure have a good memory. This is really strange. I don't think I was adopted because of the way I am. Probably the same with Seifer, too. You two must have been at the garden by age five or so. Even so, he's never mentioned anything about growing up in an orphanage, and nothing about this has ever crossed my mind when I see him. Either. Don't you find that odd? That is strange. In my case, I had loads and loads of fun after going to Trabia. That's probably why I forgot all about my childhood. That's what I think. But I don't know what's up with you guys. It's so odd that you would forget. I... I remember, yes, I remember now. Things didn't work out too well at my new home, so I came to the garden at the age of 10. That was when I first noticed Seifer and Squall. Seifer and Squall were always fighting. Yeah, Quintus always used to break us up. Yeah, that's right. Seifer was a kid who always needed to be at the center of attention, but Squall always used to ignore him. 
but eventually they would end up fighting. Squall could have easily walked away from it, but always took up the challenge. He should have just ignored him, but Squall almost in tears would say, I gotta do my best by myself or else I won't be able to see Sis. I guess I was trying to take Sis, I mean, Alone's place. I've tried, but to no avail. That's probably it. Even after becoming an instructor, I couldn't stop thinking about Squall. I thought it was love. I had to hide my feelings because I was an instructor, but I've come to realize it wasn't. It was my childhood feelings as a big sister that lingered. Oh well. God damn, that was a lot, woman. Yo, this is getting out of hand. We're forgetting way too much. No shit. Hmm, I can't remember. The orphanage is located. Go talk to Quintus. Seemed like she was shocked. Yeah, yeah, we'll talk. Hey. A misunderstood love? Actually, I had completely given up when Leona came into the picture. Hey, it must be the same for Seifer. I'm sure Seifer has forgotten his childhood too. But whenever he sees Squall, his inner feelings start to boil and... Well... Is that why he's always picking fights with Squall? Why is it that we forgot? We grew up together as kids. How is that possible? How about this? The price we pay for using the GF. The GF provides us its power, but the GF makes its own place inside our brain. So you're saying that this area is where our memories are stored? No, that's just a rumor. The GF critics are spreading. So if we keep relying on the GF, we won't be able to remember a lot of things? There's no way Headmaster Sid would allow such a dangerous thing. And how is it that I remember while everyone else has forgotten? Well, in my case, I had injunction to GF until recently. That's why I remember a lot more than you guys. How about you, Selfie? Your first experience with a GF was when you came to Blame Gardens, right? Yeah. You gave up our memories in exchange for power? That's rough. Is it because of the GF that we forget? Is that why other forces refrain from using GF? Uh, I have a confession to make. Oh, okay. When I was 12, I went on an outdoor training session. I found a GF inside one of the monsters I defeated. I junctioned that GF for a while, so I have experience with GF too. But, but it's really weird. I can't remember the name of that GF. It must have been the GF's fault. What should we do? What should we do? Nothing. What do you mean, nothing? So what you want to do? You want us to stop using GF now? As long as we continue fighting, we're indebted to the powers of the GF. Uh, if there's a price I have to pay for that, I'll gladly pay it. Hey, I know, let's all keep a diary. That way we'll always have something to remind us. That's actually a good idea. Are you sure that's what you want? Maybe that's for the best. Maybe remembering all the war crimes isn't a good thing. Yeah, I don't care if I forget about my childhood, when Seifer used to pick on me. What's important to me now is having the power to protect my parents and the lamb. They adopted me. There's no way I'm going to let go of that power. Hey. Do you all remember Matron? She was r always wearing black. Let's see. Matron dressed in black. She's the... Uh... Oh, it's very kind, long black hair. Yes, I really admired her. Are you the actress? I see a resemblance, Matron. They look alike. Wait, I just pictured her face and look alike. Nah, that's not it. Matron's name is Dima Kramer. Oh, shit. Matron's a sorceress. Oh, shit. You're wondering why Matron would take over a country or fire missiles and whatnot? At this point, we probably wouldn't comprehend it even if we talked about it. You're probably right. Oh shit, hear me out. CD and Garden were all Matron's idea, right? I'm not a CD, but I share the same feelings with all of you. CDs are supposed to fight the sorceress, right? This is this is weird, this is weird. That's right, it was when I was being tortured by C but he wanted to know what CD was. Matron should know, but Matron is sorceress. There's no denying that. Uh, what does this all mean? Oh, shit. Squall, you listening to me yet? Kind of, sort of. So, like, this is what I wanted to say. 
Let's see. Oh, yeah. I understand what Riona say. I understand, but I'm still gonna fight. I want to stay true to everything I've stood for. I'm sure it's the same for everyone. That's why I thought it'd be best if everyone we knew knew we would have to face Matron. You've all heard this before. How's life? How life has infinite possibilities. I don't believe that one bit. There weren't many paths for me to choose. Sometimes there would only be one. From the limited possibilities I have faced, the choices I made have brought me this far. That's why I value this path I chose. I want to hold true to the path that had to be taken. I know our opponent is Matron, whom we all love very much. We might lose something very important on account of the GF, but I don't mind. It's not like I drifted here on the tides of fate. I'm here because I chose to be here. And more importantly, we all grew up together. That's, that's fair. But due to various circumstances, we were all separated. As a kid, you couldn't really go out on your own. There were no other paths to take. All I did was just cry. But... But somehow we're together again, just like old times, though things have changed. We're not kids anymore. We're strong. Enough to take care of ourselves. Make our own decisions. We're confronting a big one right now. Do we fight Matron or not? I say we fight. Shoot for a common goal. Hey, at least they'll keep us together a little bit longer. Yeah, let's do it. We can run from her for the rest of our lives. Oh, we can't. We can't. Uh, it's such a bummer. I can't believe we have to fight Matron. I know, but Zell's right. We can't run from her forever. Y'all grew up together. It's up to you, lady. We're gonna fight. I think it's the only way we can move on with our lives. If that makes any sense at all, come with us. I'm sure that's what everybody wants. Look, look! Oh, is it snowing? A gift from the fairies! Ma'am, that, that, that's just called snow. Uh, yo, you wanna go check out orphanage? I wonder what it's like now. We might find blue. Blue, you mean as to why Matron turned out like this? Probably has to do with something that happened in the past, but the past is the past. Over, done with. Despite the truth we find, it's not going to change the present. But, I want to see too. I don't know what we'll find, but let's head for Forcerous's house. I guess that's it. We're fighting. Yep. You guys are fearless. Fearless. I don't think that's quite right. If you think too hard, you become lost. I think that's what everyone's afraid of. I wish we didn't have to fight either. Hmm. Well, give me. Nah, I'm gonna stick with Zell and. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's go find the house. I have no idea where the fuck it could possibly be. Uh, it's on the coast. We know that much, so... Get me off of this mountain. Uh, into the ocean I go. Yeah, we know it's on a coast. As I said, it was on the beach. I don't think it'd be on this little island here because this is where the lamb and all that are. Yeah. Yeah, so let's travel south. Okay, no, that's the... Ah! I went back to that little island. I don't want to go to the little island. I want to go... 
This way. Nope, nope, no turn. Forward. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go find that. I just spotted it. We have found it. it. Alright, so before I go in and do all of that, uh, we're actually going to go down the stairs. We're gonna go down to the dormitories and I am going to save. Because I know there's a save point in my bedroom. And that is what we are going to do. Uh, floor one. I don't think there's a save point on floor two, but I know there's one on floor one. Uh, in the dormitories, which is. Yeah, because you're not dormitories. Yeah, no, you're infirmary. Is it pink? Quad? No. Yeah, I think it's like in the back deck. Yeah, your cafeteria. I think white is dormitory. Yeah. White gray is dormitory. And we're gonna head back into my room. And we're gonna save, and that's where I'm actually gonna call it for this episode. Uh, because this was a lot of stories. Uh, so I want to thank you all for coming out and hanging out with me today. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you want to. If you don't, that's perfectly acceptable too. Uh, I just hope y'all have a great day. And this episode made me sad because they grew up together and they don't remember. Like, what the fuck? That's fucked up. Like, what? Anyway, uh, I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.